Hey, it's Travis with WKDQ. And Gavin from 1061 KISS FM. And someone who needs no introduction is the Green Power Ranger. I know, he just wandered in out of he's, nowhere. He's here in Evansville. And uh, you left the Dragon Zord at home, but you brought some kind of way of transportation that you've been spotted around town on. So can you, uh, can you show us how you've been seen around town? Okay, let's go check it out. Alright, so uh, we did a no-no. Oh, what have you done? Um, I revealed the true identity of the Green Ranger. It's like when the White Ranger got revealed, they're like, it's Tommy It's again. Tommy! It's Tommy again! But this isn't Tommy. Your name's not Tommy at all, is it? So what's your name? Nick. Nick, and you're from the Tri-State, right? You're from yeah. Newburgh. Yeah. Newburgh. Yeah. Alright, cool. so you started riding around on your motorcycle dressed as the Green Ranger how long ago? Uh, it was two weeks ago, three weeks ago. And that's about the time when I was sent a picture of you riding down the Lloyd. I'm like, that is the coolest thing I've ever seen. I had to get you in the studio, and you came by today. So this is your own little Dragon Zord. What uh, what kind of reaction have you gotten from people riding around in town? I mean, honks, people want me to pull over and say hi, give the kids high fives and stuff. It's great. I have love you it. done it? Oh yeah. You have a lot of oh, photos yeah. and everything. Oh yeah, photos you, everywhere. Do you have to play a flute to make your uh, bike appear to you, or? Is it I just park it normally, but I mean, the flu would be nice. <laughs> Do you have any plans on becoming a White Ranger? I haven't, I haven't thought about it yet. I mean, bike screen, maybe a paint job, maybe a White Ranger. Even White Ranger. So, oh. I don't know. Uh, well, what made you come up with the idea to dress as the Green Ranger around town? Well, your bike? a buddy I work with tagged me in a picture on Facebook, and uh, he was like, "You should do the Green Ranger." And I was like, "That's perfect. It's like, it'd be great for the kids everywhere in town." I have a four-year-old, and he loves it. My nieces love it. It's great. It, it is pretty entertaining, and I think it's the coolest thing I've ever seen in Evansville. So, where, where did you get the where did you get the gear at? Because like I know you can't just find this at Walmart. Where did you find everything at? Uh, Spencer's online. Really? Cool. Yeah. We gotta look up there. I know. We gotta look it up. Is there anything that you've always wanted to ask the Green Ranger? He's standing in front of us. I, I don't know, man. It's just. So, are you and Kimberly ever gonna like it together? <laughs> I've been hoping. hoping. Now, there's there's no one that will come in the way of that, right? Like. You don't have any significant other that's gonna get jealous of you and Kimberly. Maybe, maybe, uh, maybe. That, yeah. that could be it. Uh, Green Ranger, Green Ranger. Though. That's right. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> what Green happens Ranger. in the costume stays in the costume. Oh yeah. Perfectly acceptable. Okay. Well, I'm going to uh, give you your helmet. You can get back to action. See what I did there? That's what they used to always say yeah. when they put the helmet back on. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, thank you for stopping by. We oh, yeah. appreciate it, and, and I'm sure. Yeah. We'll be seeing and for the and, and for defending the Angel Grove of Evansville. So we appreciate you. that so much. I don't know. No. Maybe. I don't know. Just go, go. Go, go. Yeah. <laughs>